nowhere, I can't get the pounding. Keep the metal top, metal up like I'm jousting. I'm fresh out of work. All right, this is the battle we're all here for. That's crazy. I'm good. Y'all can hear me? Who won, who won the first one? Yeah, me. No? Yeah. Heads or tails? Heads. Look, they said neat. He's got tails. All right, he could go first. Right. Let's get it. Well, well, well. They really got me back here battling you again? We got Snowman versus... I already killed you, nigga. What the fuck are we doing here? Last time you rapped for five whole funky ass minutes. And half that, I got you the fuck out of there. Fuck a vote. I'm trying to get shit clear. You could never, ever fuck with me. I'm being sincere. Fuck how you flip snow. You're not a dope dealer. You're probably a cashier. Talking all that cash shit. Let's kick it up to fifth gear. You said dumb monkey nigga and had the whole squad laughing. I like that shit too. It was actually funny. I almost lost to that though. Shit was tragic. Nigga got up here and said a bunch of dumb shit, but fuck it. Let's get back to punching. I'm the creator, a man of action. Snow make big chill, then his brain shatter. If I raise an arm, y'all gonna see big gray matter. The alien, I'll up four arms and let heat blast and split shit. Head honcho, a masked bounty hunter, like 6'6". Six, six. I'm real sick, airing at your Ken, flaring it again, talking monster, bird, shooter, house of imaginary friends. See, I can say silly shit and make it sound cool. After this, you're gonna be wondering how I got the round, dude. Fuck this fossil, the dirt gonna surround you. Lex is a mastermind, school of fiends, brother blood. He can't do nothing till his team tighten up. Welcome to Jump City, we don't see one-on-ones. Long coat and a mask, tucking a mean Tommy drum. Outside his crib in the grass, waiting until his family come. Bullets cracking the glass, hit the mom and papa son. Is you dumb? Is you stupid? Jericho and O2, I'm undisputed. Fuck you, I can't go toe-to-toe -to -toe with you, or blow to blow. You're the type to go to war for a hoe, like Obito. Shots leaving comatose. The way snow up the nose, he start having an overdose. Any block we bend knows, every junkie had a long night. On the corner, drawing pipes. Yeah, I heard it all before. I done seen more snow flips than Sean White. To beat one of the guys, you gotta sacrifice. I mean, die, go to hell, battle me and the afterlife. But you sorry as fuck, you not even half as nice. Strong right, make his flesh break. Upper, make him levitate. Let's set this shit up. Today is his death date. The King Cold, a real tech squeezer. Sun in a snow in a Gundam, the mech freezer. Last battle, you tried to make fun of me because I like anime and video games. The fuck? That shit was lame. That's how you feel? I'll drop home. Cock and steal. Last time I said chalk zone. Cause yeah, I got cartoon bars, but everything I draw is real. You sorry as fuck, nigga. I can't confirm. Stubborn, stubborn as fuck. I guess he ain't learned. I already killed this old bitch. The mummy returns. Fuck how you rap. It's finished. This whole first round, a scrimmage. Niggas like you can't even fuck with my after image. How the fuck you gonna win and you die, nigga? Yo shit solid, but my shit gas. I got it down to a science, nigga. Get in the lab. Real shit. All right, good shit, Snow. Good shit. It's on you, Charles. Snowman, I told y'all last time this little nigga don't know nothing about that game. I got multiple plugs, plenty Chico's, pulling up back to back to drop that real snow off to me, nigga. I mean, Cuban after Cuban. Got me sounding like Glorilla. My brother's super loyal. Together, we came up out that sandbox, playing all four corners of that diamond, pitching white across the plate like sandlot. To you, that movie was a coming of age story about kids not wanting their summer fun to stop. But to us, the real plot was getting a clean ball from the food of that dog so we could be little giants standing tall on y'all block. You new young lame niggas ain't got no honor, loyalty, or any level of integrity. When I was a young nigga, Street Sniper was my pedigree from three or four blocks down. Zero scope 308 rounds. I could hit all your extremities. Life is a war zone and multiplayer, but ain't no respawn or artificial engineer vicinities. I was raised right, so when I walk up and kill you, I'ma show a little chivalry. Snub 38 behind your ear. <laughs> oh you heard God. it, but you didn't see it. Nigga, what, nigga? Run it back, nigga, run it back, run it back. Hold on, nigga, hold on. An artificial engineer vicinity, I was raised right. So when I walk up and kill you, I'ma show a little chivalry. Snub 38 behind your ear. You heard it, but didn't see it figuratively and literally. Now I done saved you the suffering of watching yourself die. Because you have lost all your responsibility. For three weeks, I'ma scope and peep with this dot on the tape <laughs> and the was... drape by my feet. Focus, yes I am. But I know the stash house resemble a beach filled with tan. I'm talking about 
super white, a little brown, and some tan. We're going to be doing push-ups with your dope. Because seeing my family matters more to me than y'all can understand. In here, it's at least 616s of them motherfucking yams. And I felt right at home when I came in with the chrome to meet the grams. The I'm here to kill everybody. I'm the designated hitter in this lineup. I got rounds for all y'all. Clip longer than the baseball game before the pitch time up. And tell your brother... He better know it's smarter to lose than advance in this tourney and have to face me. Because the OG backed in the corner with the Sig Sawyer, ready to terrorize Terraform to ensure my safety. So I done hopped up out the grave, shooting flames, melting snow, and it's still starting to shine and glow from the increased degrees. Just like I heard them old folks always say that death surely comes in threes. And I know the secret that you hold so close. Use a pussy. Your bitch the real killer. Shawty had an abortion. She wanted that baby to go. Now you out here have a her to train you with murder skills because the bitch that truly killed the nigga before. Every nigga with me real killer. It's what? what? Every nigga with me real killer. It's much more important for us to make it home than it is for you to make it out that ICU. It's a fucking fact. The mini AR in the car. But the baby, 380, is on me while I'm rapping right fucking now. I'll shoot you in your fucking face. Bystanders recording with their phones like, wow. They really confused and like, how? It's like watching old school karate flicks. Your mouth motions ain't matching your sounds. And like I told you, I ain't got to search your socials to come up with no personals. Because personally, you don't mean shit to me. And personally, I kill your bitch ass. And that shit ain't got a rhyme. Fuck, nigga. Yeah. Yeah. Nah. Yeah. 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 That was crazy. That was crazy. That was crazy. Yo. Oh, yeah, Calico. Mix with Swamp. All right, Frank. What? Frank, go first. What's your... Okay, yeah, okay, go okay, first, okay, Frank. Okay. Mix um, I'm not going to lie. I, you know, Snowman, you have... Um, uh, charisma and you have very good cadence. Your delivery is very good as well. Um, a, a couple more haymakers for sure, but I really like it. You know, how you rap is good. But, um, Big Charles, although you don't punch as much, the realism in your delivery and the u- uniqueness of your delivery and the personality that you put into your delivery really uh, makes up for anything you might be missing. I think you got this battle. Uh, salute my first time hearing you. Salute to you, Big Charles. I'll go next. I'll go next. Uh, I'll start off with the winner, man. I had Big Charles taking this one rather clear. Um, there was a clear separation and just, and just, I mean, the, the guy brought it up. He's talking about performance, but that performance aspect is, is something big. The way he said Kirbin, um, the, shiver, <laughs> the chivalry bar was dope. I, I put down storytelling. He had some storytelling schemes in there. I didn't love the, the disc scheme with the meet the grams and the family matters. That was I feel like I'm gonna hear a bunch of those tonight, but overall, I mean, you definitely captivating. I loved your performance. Snowman, super solid. I wrote down imaginary friends. I like the snow flip Sean White thing. Um, but yeah, I mean, you were solid. I just feel like Big Charles came in here and he kind of and he kind of styled on you in, in, in a lack of a better lack of a better term or sentence. So I have Big Charles taking this one quite decisively. Um, I'll go next. Uh. So for uh, Snowman, I think you took a little bit to heat up in the intro, but once you started getting to it, I think the House of Imaginary Friends was a fire bar, but it kind of showed what I felt the round was missing. Like a monster shooter bird, House of Imaginary Friends could have been a bomb if it was delivered or paced better, but you kind of just skipped over it. I feel like the the, the the delivery was the problem here. Because I like your reference back, like the Jericho and O2, the Sean White, the Chalk Zone shit, it was just... I think it needed, it needed a little more subtlety and it needed to be delivered a little better. But overall, solid round. Um, Big Charles, when I judged the first battle, I said that you sounded way more comfortable rapping uh, than Snow. And I think that with time, your creativity is going to continue to improve, like pen wise. And judging the second battle, I think it's already starting to improve. Like, I like this round a lot more than the last one. And I got Big Charles. Dice. Yeah. Uh, Snow, I, I just feel like. Um... Charles had literally the, all the attributes that you were lacking, and that's why it seemed like there was that big of a separation. Um, your pacing was a little too slow for me, but uh, you did have some bars that could potentially be fire, like Apple was saying. Now, Charles, I think you was really good personality-wise, performance-wise, and all that, but I'd be feeling like syllables be kicking your ass. I feel like if you just if you uh, uh, fix that up a little bit with rhyming, um, a little bit more fluidly, 
I think that you could actually you would be a a, a big problem. You understand what I'm saying? So like, uh, yeah, I had Big Charles clear though. So yeah. Nikefe, close it out. All right, man. Uh, oh, wrong, wrong method. Um, all right, all my fault. Uh, um, yeah, but hey, you're not me, bro. Stop. Yeah, they sound exactly Snowman. the same. Oh my god. Uh, anyway, Snowman. Um, I was writing stuff down. That, like Appa said, the House of Imaginary Friends was pretty cool. If you would have set it, set it up a little bit better and did something else with it, it might have been a lot better. But um, the Teen Titan, I like the pocket that you were in, but it didn't give me the punch that I was looking for at the end. Um, snow up the nose, and I like Deshaun White. Deshaun White, I just I liked it. I actually liked it. But Big Charles, man, he started out with the crewman on crewman, Glorilla Fire, White across the place, Sandlot, Lil John on y'all block, Respond War Zone Fire, the Chivalry was fire. Meet the Grams, <clears throat> Meet the Grams took a little too long for me. Death coming threes, um, killed the nigga before, and then this will won me the battle for you, uh. The 380 on you right now, I believe you. I honestly believe you. So, yeah, you got it. Yeah, that's a fact, too, my nigga. Appreciate it. <laughs> <laughs> I believe you, man. No, no pun intended. I believe nah, you. Nah, salute. I'm salute, with you. for real. I'm Great with battle, you, guys. I, I, agree with, I agree with the judges, and I think that, I think that um, Snow and Charles, you both can really benefit from some haymakers. Um, Snow, you had that um, House of Imaginary Friends bar. That's kind of like when your round really started, and you're going to need a couple of those. Um, hey, I'm feeling that concept, though. You know, you're going to need a couple of those to be people instead of just – for. we should be able to name like five or six of them from your round. Um, Charles, you, you, you up the Haymaker game, and it's game over for a lot of people, man. That was a crazy battle, though. I really appreciate you guys. Thank you, man. Appreciate the opportunity, man, for sure. Yeah, salute. Crazy. Hey, trilogy. Can't wait to see you around two. Trilogy? Hey, trilogy. Yeah. I can't wait to see you around two, Charles. And, and Snow, I got you. I'm going to wait until niggas forget about this battle. I'm going to steal that bar and I'm going I'm to structure it better in a, like a versus like <laughs> reverse people <laughs> or something. To be right? I'm, no, I'm stealing that bar. That bar is crazy. It was just the structuring of it. The, the, that concept is insane. Like the shooter being Will, the monster being at war, <laughs> and the bird being Coco is crazy. That bar is crazy. <laughs> I'm stealing that shit. Hey, that Sean White shit was fire, Snow. I, I forgot to say that. Yeah, the Sean White I was said crazy. That. The, I was the one that said that, though. Nah, so, like, salute to you for saying that. For, nah, salute problem. for you for nah, noticing. Shut up. You got the problem, no, bro. Fire. That but he fire. didn't need props for giving him props for it. Please? Nah, salute that's to you for yeah, noticing. Because you, you went before I could. Yeah, nah, I'm good, bro. All right.